Greetings and salutations, my name is Eric, and we have a large damp egg to hatch. And I have finally have a plan for today's episode. Oh, pinking. Nice, nice. So, uh, in the last episode, if I'm not mistaken, our base leveled up to level 10. Let's come over here and see real quick. Base upgrade. So we can have two bases now. And what I want to do is remember the last time we had a metal and coal base like up here. I think that's going to be patched, but I do want to make the most use out of it while we still can. So I'm probably going to fly up there and we can work on building that metal and uh, coal base this episode. And then I want to take this base, since we have metal here, we won't really need it that much anymore. Uh, and I want to re rebuild the base over, I think I'm going to pick right here, because right here is a place where there's two different temperature zones. And I want to build a breeding facility, so the eggs can have, there's a higher chance that the eggs will be the proper temperature, so they hatch faster, if that makes any sense. Plus it's a nice flat area that uh, I find we haven't really built in at all, ever. So, uh, let's do that, eh? What's shiny? Oh, is that shiny ruby? Okay, sweet. Uh, you two having a good time there? Alright, let me... Actually, let me get off you. Oh god, we're so dead. Jesus, Pete! One more? Why are you looking up in the sky? You got brain worms? Yeah. Nicely done! <gasps> so it only has Lucky on it, but that's fine. But we better get out of here before we die a horrible, horrible death. I hate getting stun locked like that. Just run. Uh, do north. Excuse me, can you please leave me alone? Uh, what I was saying was, from the Catrice boss, if you go straight north, you should be able to run across the base location. So, uh, let's do that. So, up there is where we want to go. I was only a little bit, I had to go a little bit to the wet. Actually, that's pretty darn close. <laughs> Oh, anyways, anyways, uh, turns out there's a sulfur node right over here in case we ever need a little bit. I never knew that was there. So, if I just creep on up here and we can get started. Oh, oh, and if you end up enjoying this video at all, consider liking and subscribing. I greatly appreciate all the support recently. Oh, we have some visitors. The, I'm going to probably want them just to blow up. Oh my god. Oh, egg. Nice. Um. What? Dang it. I thought I was being sneaky. Oh god. Ouch. I would... I would like this back, please and thank you. There we go. Yoink. Uh, let's see. Do we have any unwelcome guests still? But we do have honey now. One. Sing up. Really? Really? Can I not catch a break? Really? I don't even know how I'm going to take care of those guys. Am I? <sighs> okay, so I leave and come back, and there's noticeably less of them. Air cannon. Now, you all will come over here. Please? Oh, heck and jelly smack it. <laughs> and for any of you invested in the deep Eric lore, I uh, ate too many brownies and now I don't feel well. <laughs> womp womp. So one, two, I only see two. I can probably deal with that, but they're almost level 30. You even have the boss symbol next to you. Uh, wish me luck.
<laughs> nice. Okay. One more. Wow. Look at me go catching insert pal name here. You get the idea. Oh. Oh, I didn't see that one there. Sweet. Oh, man. Oh, man. Sweet. Okay. Uh. So there's two of them stuck down there. Actually, what we can do is B and then... Oh, no. Okay, two wood. Two wood. So come over here. Get the two wood. Put down the pal box. Oh, heck. Uh, let me drop. Actually, let me... Okay. And then we can put down the pal box and it'll stop stuff from spawning up here. So B... Oh, my bad. Jesus, P, I can't count. Pal box. I'm just gonna plop it down up here and then we can fix it later. Good. Okay, good. Now, let's go home. And, uh... Heal everything up. Oh man, that was I was stressed. All right, so now we can B C and then destroy that Yes, since there's not Excuse me You weren't supposed to do that what the <laughs> what the <laughs> what? Really 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 Really? Okay, keep it up. They, they can all destroy themselves. I'm just gonna regen some Stam. I should probably try and catch a couple. Uh... Oh, that's, that's a lot of damage. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, God. Is this getting old yet? Nailed it. Are, are you, are you kidding me? Where are you? Th this is getting ridiculous. This is getting absolutely ridiculous. Are you at least good? Or are you, oh, God, okay. Yeah, you're good. Yay, there we go. So now what if we fast travel back to up here? Okay, yeah. And then we... Nightwing. Oh, yoink that egg while we're at it. Yoink. Now, is there any bad hombres here right now with us? No? Okay. So what if we build the foundation first? Let's get off you, put you away. Then B, then foundations. I, I left all my stone at home. Now, I do have structure decay turned off. So... It will be fine for now, but what I want to do is I want to make it so we can put the pal box right here in the middle. So in case something accidentally destroys the foundation, the whole base doesn't go kaplooey, you know what I mean? Uh, so this might take a bit of trial and error. Unless. 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 Did that work? Uh, we'll have... Ooh, that looks pretty darn good. Let me destroy the box. Does that look good, though? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Uh, mm. All right, so we come down here, and then B, C, destro destroy. Yes. Okay, we got our stuff back. Now, Nightwing, are we going to die an instant death? Probably. Is it going to be funny? Probably. What if you 
see nothing. B. Pal. Okay, okay, and then, and then, and then, we fast travel back home, we fast travel back home. Okay, 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 okay. And then we fast travel back, because it'll make everything despawn. Yeah? Yeah? Okay, and that... Is that not... Is that... Like, I know... Okay, so I know it's for forward this way, but that's because we spawn behind it. Okay. Did we just do it? Uh, the, these are a little high up. How, let's see, foundations, do I want roofs or stairs? Let's try stairs. Can I put the stairs all the way around and it, will it look nice? That's important. Uh, let's put, yeah. Yeah, oh no. Oh no. The, are these too high? Heckin' dang nabbit. Dang nabbit. Mm, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Well, I just discovered something. So stone stairs, you know how we tried doing this? So build the stone stairs and then it says not connected to a structure, right? So just okay, B, C, destroy that, B, and then uh stone slanted roof. Okay. Put you down. You, you can do it too. Why why do you work like that and not the ramps? So, pro tip, if you watch that long, I guess use stone slanted roofs. I don't know how the pal pathing is for that, but so now I want to destroy all these foundations, since I think that's a decent enough spot for the pal box, and organize it, like, lay it out so it looks nicer. And I have to remember, so over here, from here all the way to over here is the free space where there's no, like, ore spawns. So that's where I'm going to set the set up the majority of the living quarters, kind of like last time, but I want to make it look a little bit nicer. So I'm going to experiment with placing down these foundations and I'll bring you guys back. But this this two, two uh, roof thing is absolutely nuts. So the important part is we got the pal box down. So now nothing will spawn over here and we can come back over here anytime we want to harvest stuff, stuff and things. However, I was looking through the tech and we get the breeding farm at level 19. Good. But we don't get... Where is it? So the fluffy pal beds to level 24. Uh, and then the improved furnace to level 34 and I don't even the large pal bed I don't see where the big old spring is I probably scrolled past it already but like I don't think we should invest too too much in this space because there's gonna be more important stuff coming up in the future but I did make it so I in places where there was a little gap I put a second um what's the word roof there so now it should be flush all the way around except for in the corners where we can put stuff and things and this is going to be the start of the new base. Uh, I'm trying to determine where, like, what I want the facility to look like, you should say. Like, over here, like, this part is pretty flat along this edge, if you follow the cursor. However, I want to avoid this corner as much as possible, because I have a feeling pals will just get stuck down there. Like, the freaking chumps that they are. Ah, oh, man. Oh, I thought that was something down there. Oh, we got pretty flush to the edge. Oh, we... <laughs> oh, we're good. We're good. All's good. Oh, but one guy I want to put here just for a little bit is the Mossanda because he can help chop down the trees. Uh, where are you, pal? You are right here. If I plop you down there. Hello. Yeah, he'll just go and chop down the trees and make it nice and easy for me. Good work, buddy. Keep up the good work, pal. You are adorable. I love you. I think I'm going to work on dismantling this base and transferring everything over to the coal and ore base and then building another base over where I said I would around over here to for breeding stuff and things. I think that'd be a pretty good idea. I am so thankful for the update that lets you walk super slow even when you're encumbered. It's so useful. Wow, what is this? Four episodes deep and all of our worldly possessions can be held in five small boxes. That's uh, pretty rough. Now, we're over at that place that I said, first of all, it's really close to the desert and the Nightwing and Felbat boss and the Quiverin and the Demud. <laughs> it just keeps going. 
Uh, so we could farm those up pretty easier in the future. But I want to find a nice place for the POW box. Uh, like, I'm trying to line it up to the, like, right there, I guess. Does it show the ring before I put it down? Is that the ring? I'm going to assume so. Okay, that's a that's a half decent size. Yeah, I think I think that'll work. Plus there's a rocks. Actually, let's get an aerial view. Let's see. That one two. No, I'll take it. That's a big flat area that we can do stuff and things with. Nice. But I'm definitely going to have to make some defensive walls sooner rather than later. Uh, what level are they learned at? Are they not... Hello? Oh my... Level 29! I think wooden walls it is then. Yoink. So, I have good news and I have bad news. The good news is this is the biggest area that we can possibly... like That I'm going to limit myself to building with. Oh heck. Yeah, that doesn't clip, so that's fine. The bad news is, see this foundation right here? It clips with the stairs that would go right there. So I had to remove it. So, okay, I can still run straight up. I don't know how the pals are going to handle that. And I'm just going to pretend I, I don't notice that because that looks a lot better than one foundation missing here. But now we can use this area to start to organize everything. Yeah. Maybe we can put one more foundation over here if we need to. And we, we had, uh, yes, some overhang the edge, but shh. <laughs> so for this base right now, I think the plan is I'm going to try to build as like many of these as possible. I'm going to build them along the outside so pals don't get stuck in them. And I'm going to leave a tiny little gap so uh, to funnel all the intruders where I want them. So yeah, just... They're a little expensive. Mm, how far out do I want it? Like half, half of, yeah. Oh, but they don't snap. Oh, this is going to be rough. Really? Really? I put down two walls. And then these chuckle nut. The, huh? Oh. That works for me. You guys can just stay right there and have a good time. I probably can't defeat you. And I'm just going to keep building my little wall. That was incredibly tedious, but also incredibly satisfying. Oh, that looks so good, actually. Uh, I'm going to make sure like it's perfect when we do the stone ones. Now, the thing is, if we take this, and if we go like this, I think it'll start sending some special raids at us to try and break it down. But if we leave a little gap, what if we like... Go like this or something. They'll all get funneled into here. And since we don't have a gate, no flying raids will come. So this is our zone for breeding stuff and things. But we still got to level up. We're so close. Excuse me. I did not give you permission to enter. Yeah. Yeah. Get out of here. Get out of here. So I'm just setting up some structure stuff and things. And watch this. Look at his tiny little hammer. I love you. Yeah. And you're pretty quick at that too. So we have to make uh, a wheat plantation and we got to get wheat seeds. But I think those drop from Dinosum. And if I'm not mistaken, we have some spare money on us. If we go over to the uh, merchant in the small settlement, I think they do sell wheat seeds. Hey, I was right. All right, wheat seeds, let's buy six. So we can make two if we wanted to, one for each base. So I whipped up a mill. How about, actually, actually, I have an idea. What if we do a berry plantation over here? Nice and diagonal. Uh, I'm gonna try and make the beds organized as best as I can. Uh, let's see, because I, I want it to be efficient, so I think I'm going to put a, a feet, like, the beds over here, some beds over here, so all the guys who work, like, over here for them, and then I'm going to scatter some beds around so the pals who do mining don't have to walk as far, you know? But we can, V, upgrade a weapon workbench. What level is that made at? Weapon workbench level 20. All right, we're, we're making, we're making pretty good time. Yeah, you plant those berries, pal. Uh, that, that, that. Let's see. Beds. 
we're, we're making pretty good progress. Plus, with the wheat and the berries, now we can make cake. And I think we have enough stuff and things. I mean, not cake, uh, jam-filled buns. And so we need milk, eggs, honey, and flour. Okay. Yeah, we're making good progress. So, I don't know how we're going to fit all the large beds here. I might. Uh, well, we A, we don't have all the beds unlocked yet. But B, we have might have to use the um, good food and the, what's the word, the spas to keep pals happy. Interesting. I, I said I didn't really want to make this my m main base. I'd rather use the big flat one that we just made. But I don't know. This is coming along pretty nice. I just hope nobody gets stuck on anything, you freaking idiots. I still love you, though. I'm also building a smattering of small storage chests around the ores, not too close to make them despawn, but that way when the pals break the ores, they won't have to go as far to store them. Uh, should I do one more right over here? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Behold, heat resistant pelt armor, a little bit better. But with this, I want to go try and get my hands on something. Yeah. Eric, what are you doing on Mount Obsidian, you ask? Well, we are looking for something in particular. Dun dun dun. Just saying, the Nightwing is painfully slow. This hurt. Well, 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 that didn't take long. Look what we have here, a huge dragon egg. Don't mind if I do. This is so stressful. I'm trying to go around to the big Anubis statue to get that fast travel point too. But I gotta be careful because if anything so much as looks at me, I am instantly dead. Yep, that's three Jetragons. Well, I think, I, I kind of think that run was a pretty darn successful. And you know what time that means it is. Wait. Is that how you say it? Anyways, it's egg time. Egg time is currently on hold. Womp womp. Uh, T-Fan. Oh, another huge dragon egg. Oh, I would have never seen that if I didn't do that. Okay, sweet. Okay, now it's egg time. Egg. 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 And that's all the eggs. I'm so glad we finally got that Dormantide Ignis. Oh, and we got two levels out of that? That was a good egg. Look at all. So, oh, that's so many eggs hatched. Hi, buddy. With those two levels up, we can get the breeding farm. Cement. Uh, let's do the large toolbox. We never made any of these things. Uh, the Gigaspheres and the Weapon Workbench. So I just pulled over a couple more resources. And let's uh, work on this base a little bit more because it's nice and good or for making stuff and things. Let's wait. No, I didn't want to ranch. I wanted the breeding farm. I was gonna say, why is that so cheap? Uh, let's plop you down right here. Yeah, right there is good. Oh, and one thing to note is since it's nighttime, if we come over to this side, about right here, yeah, we get very cold. And that's why there's one egg incubator over here and the other one over here, because we have them in two different temperature zones, so eggs can hatch faster. Oh, yeah. yeah. Pal, time for your tiny hammer. Behold, three breeding farms? What are they? Yeah, breeding farms. Uh, oh, man, I don't even have enough fiber or wood to make a ranch. So, uh, for cakes, we need, what, flour, eggs, milk. What else, pal? Where are you going? Do you know? You look like you could use some cakes. <laughs> and two ranches never hurt anybody. What if we go storage, wooden chest? So then transporters just have to take whatever from the ranches and put them right here so they don't have to go as far, eh? That's a good idea. Uh, so what? We have the ranches. Now we need farms. Where are we going to put those? I do kind of want to leave the rocks in here. Really? Yeah, you stay over there, chumps. Oh, man, this is such a big space. When you actually build on a flat surface, it's like, oh, I have space. So, berry plantation, wheat plantation. I think I'm going to put the lettuce and tomato over here as well. And I have a feed box right here. I'm going to put the cooler right here. I have to go get some more organs. And then I have another feed box over there. So, I... Only thing I have to do is manually make sure both of them are filled because you want the least amount of distance between everything as possible. So I think that, and this box is going to go. So that, and then we have the food. 
crap, what else am I I'm missing? I need the mill. Can someone please tell me why I can't put stairs right there? Like, what are you clipping? You cannot be clipping into that. I think it might have something to do with the, like, f the ground here being so close to the water. Because if I raise the, the it up a bit, you can get on it just fine. But once it's a little bit lower and it clips into the ground a lot, it just, it's like, no, no, you can't do this. I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. So I'm trying to figure out a nice way to make a little, like, platform with a cooking pot in a fridge, but, like, it's being a little bit difficult. So we have the little mill over there. I think pals should be able to go right here because they can walk on top of gardens, which is nice. Uh, so we got mill, berries, wheat, cooking pot, a uh, little cooler. I'm going to put, uh, I don't know how many beds I want because I want the beds to be all nearby where there are workstations. And I want the lettuce and tomatoes to be over here. And then that leaves the whole other half of this place and the, all the middle for other stuff and things. What are you guys doing in here? I did not give you permission to enter. Do you want to be with my friends though? Hey, you want a piece of me. You want a piece of me. How do you like my speed run house? I was getting a little cold. And I wanted to take a picture for the thumbnail, but it didn't do really well at night. Uh, so we have that, that, that. I'm gonna, hmm, I want to make some more egg incubators and whatnot and really flesh this place out. But this is gonna be the start of something really freaking cool. And I want to kind of split it into two parts like I did with the Ark uh, farm stuff and things. Because this video is getting a little long. Uh, so I guess with that, thank you everybody so much for watching. I'll leave any suggestions for this place and the, uh, ore and copper or ore and coal base in the comments and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye